Okay, so we have an x and a y coordinate where our instance is, and we want to move in a particular direction. Now, we don't know, the problem here is that we don't know the exact x and y that we want to end up in. If we did, we could just set our x and y to be that, right? But we can't do that because we don't know what those are. We only know the angle that we want to move at and the amount of pixels vaguely in that direction, okay, that we want to move. Um, we can't just use that number of pixels in our x and y because we might be moving a different amount in x to the amount we're moving in y, right? We'd only be able to move at 45 degree implements, uh, increments that way, okay? Uh, but we want to be able to move anywhere, 360 degrees, in any direction, at any kind of length. Now, if you know a bit of trigonometry, you can actually work this stuff out um, very easily without using this function. But what length do x and what length do y do is if you imagine that position that we have and you know the angle that we want to move and we know the distance that we want to move, what length do x will do is given that direction and given that length, it will return the number of pixels you have to move in the x-axis um, to reach that position. And similarly, length to x returns the number of pixels you need to move in the y axis to reach that position. And once you combine those two results together, boom, you have the coordinate that you want to move to.